Okay, this is my Linux XC20, and I just wanted to see how much amp this compressor is going to be pulling when I turn this thing on. You know, this is a 1920s year air condition unit, five ton, and uh, just kind of curious to see how much amp this variable speed pulls up on the startup. So let me turn the unit on and we'll see. Okay, so I'm going to go into settings. Advanced settings, dealer control, proceed. I'm going to go into test, and uh, all this is select. So once you click on start test, click on continue, cooling minimum rate, and maximum rate. So I'm going to leave it at maximum rate and click done. Okay, so now I'm outside at the compressor, and you can see right now the unit is running at full power and is pulling about 15 amps to the uh, compressor itself you know so the way these units work is uh, they come on full power they cool the house and then they come down slow on speed so I'm gonna be showing you guys how much it really slows down and when it's running in the slow capacity or in the variable speed capacity how much amp does it really pull in so as you can see right now I'm already saving quite a bit you know before my older unit was pulling about 17 amps and this is at 15 amps at full power and uh, this these unit won't run be running at 15 amps all the time so right now uh, on this particular scenario you can see the unit is coming online uh, you know it was off for a while after cooling the house and now it's coming on at a slower speed you know it's running at a variable speed and uh, trying to catch up and see where it is going to stabilize so right now it's kind of slowing slowly creeping up the amps and uh, we'll see where where it stops so even the top fan is running very kind of slow not not much noise you know it's kind of running at a very low speed kind of medium so over here you can say it's more steady now it's running at uh, 4.82 amps um, and this is like kind of like just close to like 5 amps right so it's uh, I'm already seeing savings right there um, I've seen it gone a lot lower and we'll, we'll wait you know for it to come down even slower Okay, so now, now I can see it slows on even more, and right now it's pulling even less than 1.5 amps. There you go. A lot more savings. Hey guys, so I'm here at the air handler, Linux XC20 air handler, and uh, what I want to do is I want to check the amps of, uh, you know, how much amps it really pulls, you know, when I'm running the system at full capacity. So um, I have this uh, clamp on amp meter, and I'm going to clip it on right here and uh, kind of leave it there so it captures so I'm gonna go ahead and read right now it says uh, it is running some amps right now it's hard for you to see and the reason it's running this much is because I'm running a UV light and of course there are some electronics it's running so of course it's gonna pull a little bit of amps um, so I'm going to go ahead and turn the system on at full capacity. Right now it should be running at maximum rate. And it's a variable speed so it takes a while for it to come on, catch up to the speed. You can see the amps are creeping up a little bit. It's going to give it a little bit. See how the amps are increasing. You can probably hear the lower motor speed as well. Let me see where it exactly stops. Okay, so it's been running and it seems like it's pretty consistent at 2.4 amps. You know, it's uh, plus whatever amps the UV light is running on you know remember I zeroed it out after I removed it so you know this is pretty low my old unit was running at 5 amps for the blower motor 
itself just on its own at full speed. So guys, that's another indication that this is a much effective and energy saving unit. Okay guys, so now you saw a comparison of how much amp I was pulling in from the compressor and also on the air handler side, you know, so guys do check out my other videos, you know, I'll be showing the installation of the Linux XC20, this particular unit that I just showed you. Just uh, watch out for the links in the description below. And guys, if you like the video, please subscribe to my channel and like the video. Thank you.